Remember this guy. And the police have been pulled out and they're going to come and um, we've, we've been asked to hold you. You've been asked to hold me. We're back here to see if he's learned a lesson. Welcome back to the channel guys and girls. Today we're back at the, the famous site of the Wyman and Gordon. Well last time when I turned up there's 999 before even coming out and speaking to me. The reason I'm here, especially I did plan coming back here in the summer because when I get the new drone I want to go back to certain places that kind of did give me a bit of hassle. This place was one of them. But a couple of the subscribers and viewers uh, work in here and they've tipped me off telling me the big the big bosses from America are in this week, Monday to Wednesday. I've come back today and audit and basically see the place improve for last time. Now I can see a mass improvement because I've got solar panels there. I didn't have them the last time. So well done to you there. As I saying, when praise is due, you get it. And if you remember the video for last time, the roof was an absolute mess and I can see guys up fixing the roof. So well done in that. Well, that's the first of the praise. So two big improvements. So what we'll do is last time, it tells us I supposed to tell security. So it says all visitors and contractors must report to security office before entering the site. Now as with this argument, you can't get into site to get to the security office unless you get into the site. So what this time is it tells us use the workers gate and use the buzzer there. So before we go in here, I'm basically uh, say a massive thanks to James, who is the DJ on Saltire Radio. Uh, I choose it between 12 and 3 o'clock. He gave us a wee shout out uh, on Tuesday there. So many thanks for that, much appreciated. So we'll head up to this buzzer now and we'll go to the workers gate and we'll go and tell them we're flying a drone and let's see if they've learned a lesson for the last time or if they're going to threaten us with the police again. Something tells me it's going to be the latter, but you never know. How are you doing? I'm going to fly a wee drone over your business. Uh, you're not allowed to do that, sir, I'm afraid. Yes, am I allowed to do it? Photography on this site, please. No, yeah, that's for that's the, the workers' rules, that's not my rules. Now, basically, I'm notifying you because last time I was here, so you wasted the police time before. Was, the... If you fly your drone, I will phone the police because this is underneath the flight path. No, it's not. Listen, we've we'll, we'll checked drone assist, my app won't let me take off if I'm in the flight path. So if I'm up on this, that's the response. Even if you'd submitted us a drone permission, we probably wouldn't um, issue one because of where you are. Um, so it's not a problem for us. Right, so it's, it's a very point in the police, it's basically they're wasting police time, just be, just double checking. Yeah. Right, because they've hit me with the flight path thing, but I just want obviously for safety, just double check and keep it, keep it right. No, 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 you're doing the right thing by double checking and doing the right, because otherwise, because um, even with if you were flying within our areas that we protect, the police would, if they can get the drone triangulated, triangulated they will come out, yeah. uh, and it is an offence. Uh -huh. But where you are, um, it's not going to be an issue. Yeah, that app wouldn't let me take off as well. It would give me the restrictions straight away, as well as yeah. double checking drone assist. But that's been brilliant, that's been great. Been great help. Okay. Thank you. Thanks no for your time. Problem. Have a good day. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Well, as you see, I'm outside the no fly zone, so I'll tell them again. Oh, so they're just going to ignore. Alright pal, right, I've just spoke to air traffic control, I'm well outside the no-fly zone, so the drone's going up. I'm straight sir, the manager might be out to see you, or the police will be on their way. Well, I don't waste the police time, that's what I'm basically trying to tell you. There you go, just things up again. Absolute shocking, this bit this place. So we'll just get the drone up, since they're, they're not listening, and we'll take it for there. So we've got chop prop there, and we're going to have a wee nose to see if this place has improved, isn't it? Point As you look at the side of the building, still needs a bit of... I know the building's old, but it does look like they're doing the improvements. Look at all these solar panels there. As I say, praise for that, it's well done. Loads and loads of solar panels. So impressed with that. It doesn't even look like they're finished. 
I think that's probably my solar panel's got on the roof as well. So, I'd say we've got the zoom function this time. I only forgot all about it there. Look at the state of the roof, the now. So we missed all this last time because the wee chopper never got much of that. I thought because the bosses were here they would have done a bit of improvement. Look at all that moss. So hopefully you guys are repairing it. Fixing all the roof. Really, really bad. That's a bit of an eyesore. It's one of the worst roofs I've actually seen, to be honest. And I'm not just saying that. I say I'm getting them praise for their, their solar panels. But roof wise, nope. So we're currently sitting at 69 metres. So I'll come in with a bit of loading to be that height. And the flight path is banners. Oh, there's a way to see the back of the business because the back of the business last time was an absolute mess. So let's have a wee look round here. And thanks for the tip off at the big bosses were here. So let's have a look at the yard at the back. You know, I'm, not, I'm not really flying the drone too far away face because we don't really need to. Let's keep my line of sight. It's great when you go to zoom though. It's like a total game changer. Don't have to fly anywhere near as, as much as what I used to. But as I say, there are several places. You guys have a rough idea where these places are that I'm planning and revisiting. And so we're dating 4K. But we're just taking a look at the state of that roof. Like this, this is the worst roof I've came across all my visits. I'll take a wee look down there. Just looking at the drone up in the sky. Look, look at the state of that roof. I mean, that is shocking. Honestly, you could play football in that, it's like a football field, with a green, green on it. So definitely the worst roof ever. I thought the place in, uh, what you call it, Bishop Briggs was the worst. Up there, it's nice and clean. That's the bit they're kind of working on. Now it's just started to rain. So we'll just kind of quickly zoom in about the grounds, get as much footage as we can. This is basically just kind of to turn back up, see if the place has improved. Because I knew the, the bosses were here. So they're working on this bit here. So that's maybe why that roof's so clean. But hopefully they're doing the full roof. In the back there. I mean, look at it, the whole place. I think the bosses come from America. They've improved all this. Don't be wrong, it's probably ideal for other the work for the day in the working day, but it's nice to keep the place nice and tidy. So I'm not going to fly too far. As I don't need to, and it is raining now, so I'm going to bring Chopper back closer to his. But what we'll do is, I'll try and get the full building the man short, just, we'll take a wee thing more location. So we're in Livingston now, in the Houston estate, or Houston Industrial Estate. And this is a surrounders run about us. We'll bring Shovel back towards us and we'll try and get the full business no and show it. Might struggle because it's some size. And I don't want to go too high. Even though I'm allowed to, but it's not really necessary. So I'm not really going to bother with a full business the one shot if I don't, I'm not going to go too far back because I said the flight path is well above us but it is back, back the line, I don't want to go too far back. So there's your wine and Gordon, Gordon full business there. Just typical of the rain to make a flight a wee bit quicker than we planned. We've seen the managers not coming back out. You know, I do know he's, wait, wait, the workers call him or it's his actual name, but I'm not 100% sure if that is a... Uh, he goes with that name or that's just the name they call him. <laughs> it's quite a funny name. And it would make sense and totally relevant to uh, my thought process on with, with the phone in the place. So I'll bring Chopper back down. So for the choppering this one, I'm going to get back up and see the phone in the place. 
But before I do that, I'm going to stash the chopper ring under this stone right at this electric bit next to Raymond and Gorman sign. It's just under there. So anybody watching, first to watch it, you can grab that key ring. So it looks like I just got a flight done in time before this rain come on. It doesn't, it doesn't look like it's going to stop anytime soon. So as with the building, it's still an eyesore. Now a lot of folk have commented on it. I mean, they hate locking it when they drive by it and everything stuff. But they're doing some improvements to the roof. But they're not doing enough to the roof. The roof is... I mean, honestly, you could have a big garden up there. I mean, a green. You've seen solar panels, though, that's a massive positive. So you've got to praise them for that. Um, I just hope they do the roof and tidy up the building. So for the... Basically, site outlay, I'll get 3 out of 10. Because it is ideal for what it needs, but it is a bit of a mess. A big, a big bit of mess, that's what puts it down. Side of the building, it's a state. He's a total revamp. It's in the maybe we'll, we'll give him a benefit of the doubt, they're maybe in the middle of doing that. Sightly, it was ideal for the everyday needs though. Just could they be a bit cleaner. So, go and double check with security if they phone the police. Well, it looks like they're now ignoring me when I'm pressing the buzzer. It's now belting down with rain. So basically, they've just chosen to ignore me. So I don't pick the phone in the place. I was double checking with them if I had or not, so I waited about. But it's now absolutely bucketing down. I'm just so glad I got here when I did, because if I came in here later, I'd have missed doing the flight. And I said I was planning doing here in the summer, but because the big boss is from America were here, and thanks for that tip off in that one, I brought it forward. If you like that video, hit the like button guys. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. Cheers!